evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to a... I guess this is kind of like a special episode of the Splork Only. Because a while back, I did a video where I showcased, I would argue, my three best tanks. Not realistic, but my three just best tanks I put in the most effort. Well, actually, you haven't even seen the third one since I built that like a month, a month, month ago or so. But anyway... So basically, I thought I would showcase them again because the video only got a few views while some of the other Splork Army videos got maybe 10 views and you did not really see any necessarily tanks that stood out. So hopefully this video might get a few more views uh, so I could just really, um, you know, share with you these cool tanks. Oh well, you know, I, I think they're cool. That's subjective, of course. But anyway, first we have the Splork Apple, known as the Black Six. I don't know why I, I put that. I, I was kind of going, going through this phase where, you know, I was like, yeah, dude, that sounds so cool, the Black Six shot. But, um, you know, it, 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 I don't know why. But anyway, the first lava power tank made by Splork Inc. and Chrome Inc. Think of those as kind of like companies from like uh, Borderlands 2. Like, you have the Doll Corporation. That's th Think of Splork Inc. and Chrome Inc. as giant corporations like that. But anyway. Start off, and of course, it's well. I guess it, it, the, the tank would kind of look good in nighttime, but anyway, we're gonna set it today. The Splunk Apple One, a complete beast of a tank. Um, amazing armor, extremely well angled and sloped from the front. Now it's kind of hard to see because you have this monstrosity of uh, <laughs> a veil. I was I was really bold with this one, but anyway. So you have a pike nose, right? You know, angled left to right, so keep it uh, face towards the MA. And you also have some Olmo under heel, so it doesn't have a weak low glazes. It has double tracks of three, maybe four blocks tall. I believe. Yeah, it's three blocks, I, I believe. Uh, you have your main viewing station in the whole heel, uh, and you have two light sources there. I just want to say, I can't think of one tank that could penetrate this. Like, so basically, I mean, just like look at this hole. I mean, I mean, like great, you know. And then on the side, you have a block of spaced almo heel with a additional, uh, I, I guess, probably where you have the tracks, and then you have, I guess, I think a piece of almo there. So a lot of side almo uh, sloped as well. You have kind of a, a entry port there, uh, the wheel sloped back places one might say and you have the three exhaust ports for the lava generator I, I, I don't know how it's powered by lava but you know it's again I don't build things to be realistic so um, now let's move on to the turret from the front the turret is angled uh, the sides are angled and the top port is sloped and a little bit of the bottom is sloped as well the turret wing is pretty well protected uh, the gun, pretty, pretty massive, um, you know, it's an autoloader, I think, I mean, I, I ne I've never really thought about it much. You have two range finders on the side here with two machine guns, two hatches, um, I don't know, I guess this would be like satellites, not really sure, honestly. You have your commando scupal there. From the side, you know, as I said, we said before, you have the range finder. And the back is kind of this wheeled shape, but it's very, very bouncy indeed. So now if we go inside, um, and also it has a special marking of uh, this bloke and chrome ink. If you go inside, uh, here was the turret. Uh, that was a glitch there, but anyway. Here was the turret. Um, guardrail, storage, um, you know. Cactus. Um, here's kind of like the toilet. Um, I forget what they called it. I, a platform. Usually it's like kind of a basket, but you know, you have a platform for this one. Here's the inside of the hole. Again, I, I, I can't imagine in, in, anything penetrating this from the front. Like, seriously. Um, go down here. Uh, yeah, I, well. I just kind of ran out of ideas, really. Um. This thing back here, uh, they can sleep, I guess. You know, um, 
but yeah, so that's the Splork Apple One. Um, it's probably my favorite of the three because it was the first one I built, and yeah, it's just such such a unique look to it. I think. Um, so yeah, on to the next in the installment. The Splok Apple 2, second lava power tank, sister tank of Splok Apple, made by Splok Inc. Comic. Very similar hole, like hole design, track wise, but the actual frontal hole itself is different. See, the thing with that one is that it was very well angled and sloped, but the lower glacis was not. While with this one, you kind of fix that with only having a one block gap they are on the lower glacis. Same kind of design, really. Um, double tracks, you know, side armor. One might argue that this has even better front front armor. Um, the toad, I would say, is probably better. Um, it just, I, I, I would think that it's more armor. I, I don't really remember much. Uh, a bigger gun, not by much though, but still a bigger gun. Um, and just massive side armor. So if we go inside this one. Uh, same kind of, you know, premise, really. Um, Cupalo here. Okay, well, I didn't plan this out much, but, uh... This one's kind of more imp imp empty, really. But you kind of... You have this platform here. Uh, kind of storage bins up there. Uh, reinforced staircase. And, uh, this is kind of like how you get out, like, the emergency exits on both sides. With reinforced obsidian control blocks, so whatever, like, like you know, whatever. So basically, if somehow something get gets through all of that, that almost you're gonna have to get to a block of obsidian. Um, and you know, you got like re uh, support beams they are, and just some just like light pulse and designs for the engine, I guess. So yep, that's the uh, the the Splunk Apple Two. Uh, both of these are torted tanks, or true tanks, one might say. Well, the third one is a tank destroyer, so I just let, let you get one last look at this tank from the front. Anyway, on to our next tank, which has the biggest gun of all three of them. Tank destroyer. Splok Apple 3, third lava type, Splok tank of... Uh, Sistle tank of Splok Apple 1. This one, um is a tank destroyer. It is just almost to the absolute max. Like the entire front is just completely slow. Like just look 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 at that angle there. I mean it's absolutely massive. You still have that insane side almost. Uh, I would say the weakest part of the tank would kind of be the upper the superstructure structure side almost. I think this is only one block. Okay, three blocks. Okay, I I, I probably picked picked a bad spot to do it. But anyway, um, a, a different d d design for the engine deck, uh, but still kind of the same ideal. Pretty sure this one is kind of empty as well. Um, so go down here. Well, actually, it's not that empty really. You have kind of like the main office because you know it's like no, no, nothing's ever gonna penetrate this, so you know you can have an office. Why not? Here's the control room. Um, you have like I guess what would this be? Um, hmm, not really sure. You know, just like a bu bunch of degrees of uh, different viewpoint points and stuff. Uh, here, if you go down here, you have kind of the crew quarters because it does take a lot of crew to man this, and you have. A giant support pillow in the middle to support all of that weight uh, or help support it I should say and this one you have side ex exiting escape doors and, and entry doors so I mean just you know just the absolute like angle of this I mean dang you know so yeah those have been these slow capital tanks I probably will just continue a adding on to them because I do love building these like tanks like like this where you know I put in a lot of effort and you know Splunk Apple 1 is my favorite um, so yeah, thank you for watching like favorite and subscribe if you enjoyed these tanks make sure to go check out the original um, episode
episodes of the Slow Home only, where you can see tanks like those and tanks like all those back 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 there. So yeah, thank you for watching. Like, favorite, and subscribe. And uh, yeah.